going on everybody? It's your boy Titan C Jack and I'm back at you again with another video. I'd like to welcome you guys back to the channel. If you guys want to continue to follow me along this journey as I build my sneaker collection, there's a list of my socials right there. Also do me a favor, smash that like button, drop a comment, and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Today's video we take a look at a sneaker. Oh, it's a little bit of nostalgia from me. Uh, the sneaker came out originally back in 2015. I'm talking about the sneaker you're looking at right now, the Yeezy 350 Turtle Dog. This is the first time that this sneaker had retro since, uh, this is the first time that it actually retro. It came out in 2015. I didn't get a pair. And this is the very first colorway of the Yeezy 350. This is a V1, and this is the retro right here. I didn't get the V1s back in uh, 2015, so we're going to take a look at it right here. Here is the box, 350 on the box, 350, and boost on the side. From what I understand, the box was much different. Back in 2015, it was a fold open box. This time we got the regular box, the slide tray, and look at the label. It says Yeezy Boost 350, US size 15, and color is turtle, B L U G R A and C white. This is my personal pair. Uh, Yeezy Day, I tried, like most of you guys out there, tried to get a pair. And I struck out, but I had to reach out to them young brothers at Trade Block. And I was able to make me a decent trade on these. Comes with your regular paper, glossy, seal looking color paper. Got a little sticker inside. And that pretty much what comes with the box. Let's look at the sneakers. Here's the little Trade Block card that you get when you, uh, Make a successful trade on trade block. Kicks it here. Person that did the authentication signed it. Yo guys, it's the Yeezy V1 350 Turtle Dog. Uh, looking at it, it looks very similar to the V1. I went and watched a couple of the videos on the V1s and if there are any differences, there are very little differences to my naked eye, but uh, I really like the shoe and I wanted it. And uh, the prices for the 2015 pair of outrageous. The sneaker was in my size somewhere around maybe $2,000. Definitely not paying that for a sneaker, but from what I gather, the materials is pretty much the big difference on these um, from what I'm hearing they use a little uh, thinner type material but it's the print is pretty much the same you got your white midsole and looking at the outsole it's pretty much the same with you got the exposed boost technology got the Adidas logo right here boost and all of this is pretty much the same from the V uh, the 2015 pair and another difference I'm hearing is the inside the ankle you have padding inside of here if you can see that they didn't have that in the uh, 2015 pair the padding you got your little pull tab on the back looking on the medial side it says easy right here Let's get the other one out because it says something different. This is the left sneaker. It has the Adidas logo. And look at a couple of things on here. You can see the tag comes affixed to the left sneaker. And you got your different languages and all that good stuff. Back and front on the tags. That's what you're supposed to get with an authentic pair of these. Come with your little tissue, stuff tissue. Give you guys a look at the insert. Insert should come out pretty easily. Black insert, Adidas Yeezy on here. And that is the same on both. So 
there you have it guys this is the 2022 version of the uh turtle dove only one pair of laces let me know what y'all think it's a pretty good sneaker uh i tried it on and uh the difference between this fit and the v2 size 15 these this pair of the turtle dove is a little uh looser if that makes sense maybe i was supposed to get a 14 and a half but i got my normal uh 350 size so comment below let me know what y'all think of this sneaker and before i go like i always tell you if you can help somebody get a sneaker help them get that sneaker because you never know it will be your turn to need help getting a sneaker i'm titanic feet jack signing out